Whoa, Sash, whoa, aesthetics. whoa, is this like Sash? Aesthetics, let's get it. B, B, Kendrick Lamar performing at the Super Bowl. Whoa, now check this out. Does this mean, America, that Kendrick Lamar is officially in the Billionaire Boys Club? Make sure y'all like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's vibe. We about to get into this. And I said this because, look, Jay-Z, Mr. Sean Carter, billionaire businessman, CEO, president of Def Jam, rock nation icon. This man, what is the most rebellious thing that y'all have ever seen Jay-Z do? His speech at the Grammys? The 444 album? Some of the business moves that he's made? Jay-Z is a great artist and he also still has to maneuver in that Sexual corporate sense. Aesthetic. What what is what is what will we say? Jay Z growing his hair out. Jay got Hove got locks. Y'all could run with that if you choose. The way that he rebels is by working his way up. I'm not saying that Hove. I'm expecting Hove to be a a rebellious corporate rapper. Like, listen, I'm gonna keep it a bean with y'all. If you're expecting Hove to be that or any artist, you are wilding. You're wildin'. I would say yay. When it comes to who's the most gangster artist of all time, that's that's Kanye West. Kanye is really a, a G. When I think of like a gangster, what that is, that's yay. All right. Not to say that Jay, no, no, Jay is a gangster in another way. And it seems as if Kendrick Lamar has taken a page out of that book. And what we're saying is. Because Kendrick Lamar, he entices the imagination. He'll sell you an idea of things. Obviously, this guy knows performance artistry. We're talking about hip-hop. Kendrick Lamar, his admiration for Tupac, he's a thespian. He's a performance artist. He's at the pop-out show dancing like, like Drake in a Hotline Bling video. This guy is really, literally a performance artist. And of course, just the, the neighborhood that he grew up, the aspects of that. We know that Kendrick Lamar, he's he has some uh, interesting upbringing. And you could look into that if you want. But the point of this video is just that Kendrick Lamar is going to sell you an idea. That Super Bowl selling an idea. That's what we're saying. It's not about people have been echoing sentiments that there would be a, a pro super duper woke. And this is where I think Kendrick Lamar. Well, why didn't he perform at the Democratic National Convention? But why, when Gavin Newsom was playing, not like us was playing. They not like, uh, cut. they not like, uh, cut. that was playing while Gavin Newsom was speaking America. Now, ultimately, that's a point of interest. What we're saying here going forward with the Super Bowl, Kendrick Lamar, he is in that billionaire boys club now. Can you imagine what this is going to do for P.G. Lang's resume? Jay-Z licensed P.G. Lang with a degree of creative control around the Super Bowl. And it's, as some reports been saying, that it's Jay-Z's last time coordinating the year with the NFL due to the terms of the contract. Listen, they're trying to renew that partnership. What do y'all think? If that's the case, Jay-Z leaving and trusting his last year to make an impression on such a stage and giving an aspect of creative control and working with, working Sashi with PG Lang, they have to make a hell of a statement here. They have to. Why wouldn't you? And at the same time, if Kendrick Lamar is at the table at the Billionaire Boys Club now, why would he not progress upward in the same fashion that Jay-Z did? Y'all, if I'm wildin', if I'm not wildin', I'm not wildin'. Am I wildin'? Make sure y'all like, share, comment, and subscribe. Y'all know it's Astro Aesthetics. Let's get it. Big, big. Yeah.